then we got LA Knight. Um, yeah. Yeah. Why are you trying to click it at the same time? I'm not even on the page anymore. <laughs> oh, okay. It was just me. Oh my God. Yeah. It was you. Anyway, yeah. so we had LA Knight um, in a match against Xavier Woods because now we know officially that Kofi Kingston had ankle surgery yesterday and uh, he is not going to be at WrestleMania or at least not in a wrestling capacity. But apparently they are planning something for the New Day, including Big E. So whatever that is, that'll probably be fun. Um, I loved his gear last night. The all black. Very yeah. nice. Very nice. Uh, I did, liked that. Did, did, no resemblance. Didn't see any uh, symbolism cold. there. Um, no? Yeah. Stone cold. <laughs> um, anyway, so he loses to Xavier Woods pretty quickly. And my first thought is other than being pissed off because I was just like, what? Like, because he also lost to like a schoolboy. Okay. okay yeah. So. My assumption is that he's losing matches recently because it's just fueling, you know, that he's going to want a match at Mania. Um, is that your feeling as well? Yeah, it's, yeah. My feeling is that I, because he's so over with the crowd and people know who he is from NXT, that's not going to translate over the main roster. He still needs to lose a little bit, uh, you know, take his beatings, whatever. Uh, and, I think it's a good way or good timing right now leading up to mania because he's going to get a moment. I mean, look, he had a moment with undertaker and Bray Wyatt at raw 30 and mm -hmm. you know that, and it's going to be another moment like that. We'll say at mania with like stone cold. So, I mean, he's losing matches, but he's been in the ring with stone cold taker, you know, all I'm saying is that they don't do that to many guys that they believe in. And I think LA Knight is one of those guys. My only concern is that I've, we've seen this before where you think some guy is going to be like pushed and whatever. And then they end up just getting like obliterated in every match leading up to like mania SummerSlam or whatever. And then they end up being completely buried. So that's why I'm just like, I really hope that this is just adding to it. Like, his backstage segment where he like went up to Ray Mysterio and was like, Oh, what are you doing? You're just, you're just over here signing autographs and blah, 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 blah. Like if your yeah. son doesn't want to, or if you don't want to have a match with your son, like I'll take it. I'll even call myself LA Mysterio. And then he just like punches him in the face. It's like, that was so funny. <laughs> like that made it more obvious to me that this is what they're doing, that they're just going to push him to be pissed off that he doesn't have a match. Um, I'm just hoping that, uh, you know, as we talked about in our prediction that we hope, LA Knight wins because it only makes the most sense because he could even win over Stone Cold in a stupid way like even if it was just like a schoolboy roll up like cool that's fine like I don't care or if it's like a count out you know what I mean like he gets in at the last second and Stone Cold is standing outside the ring with a 10 I, I don't care like as long as he gets the win then I'm fine with it but if he doesn't get the win then I'm really mad 